This video demonstrates super sensitive screen technology on the Lumia 920. Unlike most smartphones, you don't have to use your naked finger. In this case, we're using gloves, and as you can see, the touchscreen still works absolutely fine. It's actually a technology for some synaptics that Nokia's integrated into the Lumia 920 here. You may be wondering whether you can actually use the keyboard. Yes, you can. It is, of course, a bit difficult. It's a bit like having fat fingers. You can see here I'm putting in a text message name, and rather than typing in, I'm going to use the voice recognition. This is a text message. And there we go. The text message comes back, gets inserted, and then you can send it off to the user. This works by putting some extra technology into the screen that basically boosts the signal to noise ratio on touchscreen events. This means the screen is able to detect low signal touch events, such as those that come from gloves. It'll actually work with anything that has some conductive properties. You can see I'm using a stylus here. Advantage of something like this is, of course, it's more accurate, so it's easier to use the keyboard. But it'll work, as I say, with anything that's got some conductive properties. That will rule out something like plastic pens, for example, but back of your fingernail, uh, metal objects, bits of fruit, things like that, no problem. The real advantage of this is clear. If you're outside in cold conditions and you're wearing gloves, you don't have to take them off to answer the phone. If you've got long fingernails, it's much less of a problem interacting with the phone. I think that's a great idea. Why should we have to do it in a certain way? You know, everyone's used to using their fingers, but really your phone should fit to you and not the other way around. So there we go. Super sensitive screen on the Lumia 920.